But the point is, is that it's the enlightened ones. The enlightened ones realize that Solomon's Molten Sea was charging the Ark of the Covenant. And the Ark of the Covenant is 2.5 cubits by 1.5 cubits by 1.5 cubits, which is 5.625 square cubits. We all know that the King's Chamber of the Great Pyramid of Egypt has a box of some sort. However, the purpose of this box has eluded critical thinking historians for decades. The conventional explanation is that it is a sarcophagus. If this is true, then why put a cherished and sacred place in such an inaccessible and convoluted area of the pyramid? Why the Grand Gallery? The Grand Gallery in the Great Pyramid is a massive sloping corridor. Why was it built with such complexity and precision? Could it have served a purpose other than simply providing access to the king's chamber, which it actually doesn't do very well? The pyramid contains several internal features, like air shafts and hidden chambers.